Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Curing Electromagnetic Hypersensitivity. And we're here to look into this experiment. Now this window that the experiment is running next to has a mirrored window film on it so we can see out but nobody can see in. What they see is a silvered mirrored reflection. So I was curious as to what this does to plants. So this is the experiment plant right here. So this was put next to the window in September and it's now December. It's now starting to show extensive stresses. So we've got these deformed leaves. This is a Dipenbachia plant. It normally has leaves the size of your hand that look like this. So this is one of the old leaves. And these are the new leaves. They're, they're very shiny, very glossy, very deformed. They've lost the patterning and it's just not growing right. Now, the other thing about this window is I've actually tested it and it actually has electromagnetic shielding properties as well. So the plant is subjected to at least two factors. One of those factors is electromagnetic shielding. The other factor is the heavily filtered light that's coming through this window. And I can tell you that this room is like a spaceship. You walk into it and you notice immediately that the light is very, very different in here. So just to verify this result, I've actually put this plant in here today. So this is the diapon back here, has leaves the size of your hand, lots of patterning. And this is our December plant. So our September plant is going to sit with the December plant and we're going to watch them and we're going to see what happens and they're getting the same water as they're in the same water trough. And this is how the Dyphenbachia is supposed to look. So the Dyphenbachia has pattern leaves, the size of your hand, and it's supposed to grow quite tall as this one is doing. So that's kind of what we're looking for, for a good growing Dyphenbachia. As you can see, this clearly is not that plant. So we're going to watch this for a little while longer. And as soon as I have more information, I will do another video. Hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.